some non-governmental organizations are enjoining more women to get into higher official positions in Ghana. Abantu for Development, in collaboration with Christian Aid, are determined to ensure more women involvement in all sectors of the economy. Females are in the majority according to the 2010 population census with some 51% compared to 49 for men. While in recent times the number of educated women have increased, very few occupy important office positions. The political arena is a field most women are discriminated against. Since Ghana returned to democratic rule, women participation in politics has been described as poor. Out of 104 elected members of parliament in 1960, only 10 women were parliamentarians. Fast forward to 1992, there were only 16 women out of the 200 elected MPs. In 1996, 18 were elected, while the number increased to only one in the 2000 parliamentary elections. In 2008, the number increased to 25. Despite the increase in number of constituencies to 270, the number of female MPs has increased by only four. Many assembly women regret they are relegated during campaigns and even after winning elections. Outmoded cultural practices are also inimical to the integration of women. If you look at where I'm coming from, they believe that women are not supposed to be in front. And at my area, we have never had even a woman coming out to contest in any political uh, 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 election or something like that. I went to the election for the first time that was the past assembly section uh, and I was beaten with 15 votes and I didn't see myself as a loser because it was the demarcation that took most of my voters away. My fam family members couldn't even vote for me. Abantu for Development, a non-governmental organization in collaboration with Christian Aid, insists women must be given a level playing field. Starting the fight for equality, over 30 district assembly women across the country have been taken through empowerment and capacity building sessions in Accra. We want to take women to a level where we are seeing 50% of women in decision-making spaces, both at the local level and at the national level. And that is why we are supporting or, or we are leading the, the campaign for the passage of the Affirmative Action Law. Officials of Abantu and Christian Aid called on other organizations to join the fight in getting more women in leadership position.